with the Europe Cup qualifier in Pool D. You remember from last year, Belgium didn't make it to the quarterfinals at the 2021 edition. Missed their chance in Graz uh, at the Olympic qualifiers, but made it up, made up for it in Debrecen. So we did see them qualify for the Olympic Games here in this uh, wonderful city. And at the Olympic Games, they made a run all the way to fourth place to Bord 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 with 61 points in Tokyo last summer. That was then. This is now. They got to get a dub. We'll see if they do it. We're just scratching the surface. Just five seconds into our first Pool D game in the men's competition. Pump the jam. Pump it up. Okay. Azerbaijan is missing Jordan Davis. He was MVP of that Cyprus qualifier. Dude scored 30 points as they beat Ireland in the final. So they don't have his services. Oh, my Lord. That was deeper than the Mediterranean. Two nothing. Low. What a shot from Polar Conley. They had to have his services here at Graz. Shooting like that. Playing some tough defense here as well. But Vort comes up short on the two-piece. Thibault directing traffic. He's going to get it over to Sellis. They have welcomed Casper Augustinian to the squad this year. He's been a revelation at six foot eight. Rebound. No longer an opportunity for that. Out of bounds. Azerbaijan. Make my day. Make my day. Tough defense here. Not making it easy on the Belgians who are looking for their first score here. There's Must See TV. Augustinian. He whoa. Whoa, whoa. That escalated quickly. He was hacked though, but. He had bad intentions for that man. Had it not been for the foul, we might have saw maybe the, the most vicious body snatching of the year. Augustinian. He knocks it in at the free throw line. Belgium's on the board. Trailing by one. How about Azerbaijan? Nice scoring pace to start this game. They lead it by two. They're showing no fear. Sellis lost the handle on it. Ball over to blue. Azerbaijan trying to pull off a, what would be a big upset. If you remember, to last year's edition. Belgium did get a win against Ukraine, but they won only 11 to 10. And they ended up not being able to come out of a three-way tie in that group. Must see TV locked and loaded. 3-3. Look at the sweet stroke from Thibault Portavort. He's made the second most twos in the league this year in terms of the world tour. Only person in front of him is Dejan Majstorovic. You can see why. Oh, man, Azerbaijan. These dudes play physical. Physical, physical. Vervort. Excellus with the precision pass. He'll get it back. He flicks the wrist. Needed to put some more muscle into that one. 3-3 three, three, it will stay. Azerbaijan on the attack. The vault. Oh, with some good defense, but a better hustle. Because that's recovered and scored. Bolot Kanli. Oh, nobody home to defend the vault. The vault. He's going to lay it up and in. Back and forth we go. I think that was thrown away. Nobody in white touched that one. So Belgium will take back over. Oh, 
Augustinian. Two for Bort. And he misses it. Oh, wow. Augustinian probably should try him more closer in. So Azerbaijan will open this possession. Here they come. Good defense. That's why we call him the vault. It is hard to get in there. 4-4. Got to the spot, hand straight up. That'll leave 3.2 seconds left for Azerbaijan to attack here. For both teams, we get a brief rest. TV timeout time. 3x3 action coming at you from Graz, Austria. A place where 3x3 continues to emerge. A place that will always have a spot in 3x3 history. As this city hosted our Olympic qualifying tournament just uh, over a year ago. See for the board getting his stroke going here early. There's Revoort to Sellis, almost mishandled. They got three to shoot. Must see TV. That one goes begging off the iron. So by John now. Oh, oh give and go. Oops, they did it again. Take another look at this connection right here. Underneath, soft hands, up and in. I'm Zaev. It's Vervort. Vervort driving, off balance. Shot too strong, kicked out quickly. Azerbaijan, they got they got to get out of trouble here in the corner. There's Vervort in hot pursuit. That ball is taken away. Augustinian to Sellis, over to Vervort. Vervort, oh, no. Deep two, no. Augustinian, nice kick out. Sellers passed up the shot, probably should have took it. Now he's gonna have to take it. And he doesn't make it. Oh, nice pass it. Foul on the shot attempt. I gotta say, Azerbaijan has been pretty impressive through the first uh, four and a half minutes of this game. Team is not backing down in any way whatsoever. I'm Zayed. Shoots the free throw, but the stroke was bro. Here come the Belgians. The ball. Over to Vodvort. Vodvort chunks the deuces. But another break. Score stays where it's at. Trying to go to the post. Comes up short on the jump hook. Augustini, he's tricky out there. If he beats you on the baseline, you don't want to be the guy that's trying to defend the rim. Misses the long stroke, can't track it down. Ball back over to Blue. At the midway point. Azerbaijan has done a great job keeping this uh, high-powered Belgian offense under wraps for now. A lot of time left. Oh, Pashayev with the moves. Couldn't finish it. The ball down low. Sellis. There we go. There they go. Five fives. And then Vervoort caught out of position. He's called for the foul on the floor. That'll be the second on Belgium. Each team with two fouls. Look again at the hookup between the Valk and Sellis. Nice off the ball action lead to a score. Meantime. Oh, something shaking around here. Big finish from Pola Conley. Augustinian 
can't track it down. So look at Pola Conley just brutalizing the rim. Oh! Man, he got higher than inflation prices. I didn't know he had bounce like that. I need to maybe do look up some more film on this man. Six to five, Azerbaijan. Wait. Uh, I think we might have a game, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> yes, sir, it, or yes, ma'am, uh, whoever might be listening. Huh? I'm an equal opportunist. All right, let's get back to it. Shall we? We shall. We saw the power. We had not seen the finesse yet. Oh, that one snuffed out. Sellers with the interception. Let's see what they do with the stolen goods. Whew. Augustine with a nice look. That pass was just off target, but I saw what I see what you were doing. I saw what you were doing there. On come Azerbaijan. Oh, that was poked away. Whistle, though. Offensive foul. Thibaut Vervoort opens the possession. They want to get it back to Must See TV. Must See TV drops it off to the vault. The vault streaks in for the score. Locked in, six apiece. Times I end, through the reverse. Oh, what a, what a tip. Two ball in the corner. Times I end, no. But Akbarov Jabrail, the 20 year old, showing plenty of bounce on that last tip for. Uh, his squad, that's the DeVolk score. And uh, then, obviously the tip after that was, was impressive. Take another look. Off the miss, skies in, lefty touch goes. Akbaro Jabrail, 20 year old. It's funny because, you know, on this, this Azerbaijan team, 20 years separate their youngest member and their oldest member. Oh, Faker, he pretended to shoot. He wasn't faking on his drive to the cup, though. Here we go, Sellis. Two for the board, for the board. He's gonna find Augustinian easy breezy. One point contest, Azerbaijan is in front. Long ball, too long. Oh, heads up pass. Azerbaijan has come to play. Augustine in cross court. Vervoort runs into a foul. They, the third on Azerbaijan. Take another look at that last bucket by the boys in blue. And here's Vervoort. Good contest on the two attempt. So the ball back over to blue. Back and forth we go. This is a 10 minute sprint. Defense turns to offense. Just like that, Vervoort will throw that over to Raluca. Raluca's already got her hands full. You don't need to be throwing her the, the ball as well. Let that lady rest. Never mind. Oh, sneaky. Nice slip to the bucket. Abzaev scores it, Celis cannot answer because he missed it. Three-point lead, Azerbaijan. Trying to work on an upset, spin, move, oh! Took him to spin class, you gonna learn. Augustinian stepping through, Augustinian off balance. Ball back over to Blue. Bashayev, he just did something dirty. He's tricky with that rock in his hand. 
He puts too much mustard on that, throws it out of bounds. But Azerbaijan with a four-point advantage over favored Belgium. Here in a first pool D action. Revort trying to come free. I think Belgium's got to play with a real sense of urgency here. Azerbaijan is not playing no games. Please believe Pashaev. He takes a bump on his way to the bucket. He was not in the process of shooting. He won't. <laughs> Taking their time getting to this possession, taking a little bit too much time. Two seconds to shoot. Tough attempt. Ball to the Belgians. Sellers now on the drive. Nobody home. He's going to finish with the one handed poke. Azerbaijan throw it away. This is where we're really going to see what they're made of. Their metal is being tested because the Belgians are charging back. Understanding what's at stake here. Revoort comes up short. That loose Wilson is going to end up in Azerbaijan's hands. Hamzaev. Hamzaev with a step back. Big bank take little bank. Revoort can't answer. It's 13 to 9. Can they stop Azerbaijan? And some of this physicality kind of reminds you of you know, how the Mongolians normally play. Teams from Ulaanbaatar, they got a lot of that physical makeup. I don't know if it's the blue jerseys too. I, there's something there. But this team is strong. And it's reflective in the score right now. 13 to 9, Azerbaijan, who won the Cyprus qualifier. Augustinian's going to deliver the package. That one's poked away. And a warning. A warning Augustinian for defending inside the semicircle after a made bucket. Can't do it. Next one is a technical. Any delay of game, in fact, would be a technical. We'll see. Pashaev, catch, shoot, missed. He wants it back, though. Pashaev, oh, mishandled it. Sellis now. Sellis up through the contact. Takes a bump. On the shot, that's only foul number four on Azerbaijan. So only one free throw here for Clerk Kent. Belgium down by three at the moment. Best he can do is make this a one possession game with 46 ticks left. Sellis knocks it down. There was a lane violation on blue. Basket counts. All right, 40 ticks to go. Deep two. No. Wolfort gives it up. Wolfort swings it to Sellis. Sellis back to Wolfort. Must see TV. Good look and a good result. The Nets are dripping. It's 13 off. So Thibault Wolfort. He's able to respond with a big two-piece combo in the corner. And Azerbaijan have a player down. That looks like Emil Hamzaev. Yeah, he had a little collision with Clark Kent. He's experiencing some discomfort around his belly button. So he takes his time. And he makes his way to his feet. Fairly low scoring contest. Azerbaijan bringing a lot of physicality into this contest, understanding how lethal Belgium can be offensively. Done a fairly good job keeping Revoort under wraps. You see Sellis making his move, and I think that's what our officials were taking a closer look at. 
Now, my opinion doesn't matter. But I don't think that that was an intentional uh, elbow or anything by Sellers. I think he was making a move in the natural flow of his movement. His arm kind of swung out. But so shot clock challenge is what uh, the holdup is now. See if they were able to get that up in enough time. The last make was a uh, Vort 2. So official Marcos Michelides with his Olympic pedigree. He's going to make a decision here. And he says that challenge is lost. Challenge is lost. Bucket counts. Bucket counts. All right. Now that that matter's been settled, we got to settle the end of this game. 23 ticks left. Pull out Conley. Sellers got caught reaching in the cookie jar. Foul number six on the Belgians. But a trip to the free throw line could make a difference here. Paulet Conley, big body, he's a bruiser. He's built like an NFL tight end. He oh, tightens up at the free throw line. Oh, but that loose ball is going to go to Azerbaijan. 17 seconds left, tied at 13. Let's see if Augustinian can hold his ground. He doesn't have to. Because of a new rule instituted this year, once you initiate a dribble with your back to the bucket, you got three seconds to shoot. So it's a three second back to the basket violation. Ball goes over to the Belgians, 13 all. They'll have the final say in this one. Vervoort's gonna use the clock. He thrives in these moments. Oh, a foul called. And Hamzaev, he's very eager to admit that foul. And not a bad one because they have they had a couple to give. Now they got one to give and only four seconds to go. They give it to Must See TV. Vort is hacked on the ground. So another smart foul. Azerbaijan has played well defensively and have not had uh, no. Oh, he was shooting. So Vort is going to get a chance to shoot a free throw that can win this game. That was not a foul on the floor. Azerbaijan needed to foul more quickly than that. They ended up hitting him on his way up, and it might cost him the game right here. Let's see if Must See TV can put his team up. He does. One last chance. It is swatted away. Kasper Augustinian made him talk to the hand as Belgium survives after trailing for most of this game against Azerbaijan. They end up winning it 14 to 13. Not the prettiest game you'll see, but a win is a.